Carolina. Was it January 2nd? January 2nd, 2011. Sunday afternoon, Eastern Time. The day Red Fire finally has retired. This is really it. Me, he's retired a couple times before. After everything that's happened, though, he's hurt. He's done. He's not going to play anymore. It's got a little shame, though, he didn't get his, like, farewell parade. You know, it's like. His big send off. Just in street clothes. On the sideline, in the Minnesota uniform, in Detroit or wherever they are. Wow, that's something like that. I mean, uh, and then his team, his old team, he really should be Green Bay right here, playing on the big screen here at Wild Wing Cafe. Wild Wing Cafe, Raleigh, North Carolina. Like Green Bay, Chicago, he should be in this game, you know, fighting for the playoffs, going on a Super Bowl run, but he's going to bow out like that, I guess. That's cool. Did they even play the Detroit? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. I should know this. But that's how insignificant it is. But it made me think that uh, I'm getting old. Like, our generation is getting old. I mean, I'm the, the Brett Ford generation. Like, I had heroes when I was a kid, football heroes. But then, like, he's my age, a couple years older. So I watched him all through college, you know, growing up. And now he's going to call it quits. So I grew up, like most kids in America, boys, want to be an NFL football star. I always still had a chance, because I have years of eligibility left in college. Since I never played football in college, um, I actually never even played in high school. But um, So I figured I'd always go back to school, get a couple years on my belt, join the NFL, or maybe just do a walk-on. I mean, Danny Woodhead right now, I'm getting paid, he's 5'6", he walked on to a team. I probably figured I could walk on to a team. Yeah, it's never too late. I'm 38 years old. I can still do it. But now, on this day, January 2nd, 2011, it's really over. Red Fox has retired. I have to face the facts. And I, Bean Block, aka Sports Thomas, officially announced my retirement from the NFL.